All right. Starting a little bit later than I planned tonight. I had to finish some food that I had. It was delicious. It was amazing. The best fucking, like, ghetto chicken stir-fry you ever had in your life. Alright, let's continue with more Spider-Man. And right now, there's a lot of noise in my background. Which, I'm not sure if my microphone's picking it up or not. It doesn't seem like it is, but who knows? Only time will tell. <coughs> Shit. I got, like, something stuck in my throat. It sucks. So, where we last left off... Holy shit, this is a long-ass loading screen. PS5 can't wait for you to fix that shit. We've now identified the officer uh, as Jefferson Davis. Oh. Skip that shit. Go ahead. Now, I believe this was the save file that I was using last time. Was it? I don't think it was. Oh, no, it wasn't. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Pay no attention to that. That was the wrong save file. Holy shit. <clears throat> Alright, somebody just slammed a door in my house. I know my microphone picked that shit up, no problem. I love how earlier today, I was like, hey, I have, I'm having a testing stream for, like, audio and seeing how well I can magic that stuff out, right? And now that the real stream is happening, all the noises are happening. So this is the save file we left off on, where we finished the second DLC for Spider-Man, and... What was the second DLC? Oh yeah, I got the shit beat out of me by, um, by Hammerhead. That's what that was. It sucked, royally. It was also... It was also... It was fun, but not fun. I didn't think the DLC was... Sorry, I had a little bit of hiccup there. I didn't think the DLC was harder than the main game. I mean, it should be, right? Should be designed, assuming that... You did New Game Plus and stuff like that. Anyways, we last left off. We finished that, and we switched to this spider suit so we can show it off. There's one thing about this spider suit that I really like is the is the headpiece. I like that it actually has fucking eight eyes on it. It's great. Now, DLC. We're moving to Silver Lining. I'm looking at my microphone right now, and I'm really amazed at how, how it's cutting out a lot of the background noise. It seems to be close to silent. Especially since people are both blasting music as loud as they possibly can in the room next to mine, and... Jane Watson, associate editor. <clears throat> and there's a TV being played at full volume. Yes, it is 2 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> I get no respect. Last night, after almost killing Magia Don Hammerhead, Captain Yuri Watanabe was forced into administrative leave. Sources say she told the chief, this won't stop me. Note, follow up on this later. Feels like this isn't the end of her story. Meanwhile, Hammerhead, who was... Feels like she's gonna be in the next Spider-Man game as a side mission. Police are searching for him, but there are no solid leads. His men are continuing to target Sable weaponry and vehicles, including something called Project Olympus. From what we can gather, Project Olympus is an Oscorp and Sable-funded initiative. Bio-enhancement technology meant to transform people into indestructible super-soldiers. Hammerhead is ruthless and insane, and now apparently indestructible. Ugh. But first things first... Figure out where Hammerhead is hiding. The question is, Hammerhead is fucking ugly. Oh, uh, you shoot him. You shoot him in the eye, like I said last time. <clears throat> hey, MJ. I'm following the police to an Oscorp plant. Sounds like Hammerhead's guys are at it again. Got any updates on Yuri? Nothing yet. 
miss her, don't you? Yeah. You were a good team. Of course I miss Yuri. She's way better than you, MJ. I know. She was the best of us. She still is. Something other than Hammerhead for a while. What do you think about taking a vacation when all this is over? Vacation? I'm not sure I know what that word means. <laughs> yeah, I'm with you. But seriously, we both need it. I'll start doing some planning. Let me know what happened to that Oscorp plant. Will do. Thanks, MJ. You're not the best, but you're helpful. I mean, somewhat helpful. I can. Do a lot of it by myself. Oh man. Now these fucking Olympus goons are a regular thing. I forgot about these guys. Holy shit. How do I deal with you? Do I just web you up? Oh shit. I'm surprised I didn't get shot there. I'm surprised I haven't been shot yet. That has to be my favorite animation. Fuck. Wait, maybe you're not laughing because you guys really are all named Vinny. If that's the case, nice to meet you, Vinny. And Vinny. And all you other Vinnies. Okay, now I'm just showing off. Oh, he has a fucking gun. No big guys with guns suck. They're the only two left, all right. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Good job, Spider Bro. My bad, that's not Spider Bro, that's uh. Ow! Fuck! Ow! Does that web not do anything? Why isn't there an upgrade for this? Should be an upgrade for dealing with you guys. Oh, you guys are the worst. I can't even heal myself. That's the fun part about this. Oh shit, I'm gonna die. Yup. There's no dodge in that. I guess I have to jump to dodge that. Because regular dodge doesn't work. How do you... How do you defeat those guys regularly? Do you just throw shit at them? You stay, you stay over there. Good job. What the hell are you doing? Shit. Just try and distract you as much as possible. Ow. That was a stupid idea. Do webs not do anything for you? I don't think they do. Web them down, web them down, web them down. It's not enough. Ow. Ow. 
I should have died there. I should have tucked that hit. There we go. Oh look, it's regular goon with a jetpack. This guy thinks he's the vulture. Oh, never mind. There's more of them. That defies all logic, it seems. I love aerial combat. Miles Morales better have a lot of this. It's fun. There we go. Now where's the rest of these guys? They're all down here. Fuck! Oh, it's a big guy. Shit. Let me, let me deal with this guy over here. Cause he is not friendly. go thanks for playing he just got smacked he went down like a sack of puppies have you been carrying that guy this whole entire time you could have dropped him at any moment Oh, hey, Sable! How's it hanging? And surprisingly, you didn't kill him like Gwen Stacy. Sable's so beautiful. She has that certain flair to her. Why are you shooting at me? Well, not shooting, but you mean interrogating. Tell me everything you know. I talk a lot better without a gun in my face. You have three seconds. Just put the guns down. One. We really gonna do this? Two, six, nine, seventy-seven, three. You're a fucking asshole, Pete. Come on, Sable, calm down. Sable, S Sable, stop it. Stop! I'm not trying to fight you. Stop it. Stop it. Bad. Don't do it. You're bad. You need to stop it. You're my friend. I'm gonna smack you in the back of your head. Bam. <laughs> Are you shooting my webs? Oh no, that's a shield. Stop it. Ow, how the fuck you hit me if I'm all the way up here? You can't catch me. You can't catch me. Why don't you trust me, Sable? We're friends. Ow. You are really fucking me up. Oh my god. You sure about that, Pete? Because we've been getting pretty close and she's been handle manhandling the shit out of me. Ow. Ow. Yeah, it's over. Huh. Sorry, Sable. I didn't mean to do that. Well, I meant to do it, but, you know, 
Not not in the mean way. She's really fucking me up. Oh my god. Oh no. You just you just really are really just putting it out there, huh? Ow, fuck. Stop it. We're friends, right? Sable? Ow. Cool, cool, cool. Maybe we're not friends. Sorry, Sable. She's really just fucking me up. What the hell am I supposed to do here? Anti-gravity field. Go. Bullshit. You can't divide gravity. Uh, electric web. Go. Bad. Bad. You can't block wind pressure. Can you? Stop it. Stop it, Sable. Oh, I thought I was closer to her. Uh-oh. Yep. That's usually how that goes. Smacking her against the wall. Alright, come on. Pete, what is your what is your game plan here? You say you can stop her if you get close to her. She she's better at hand hand combat. I'm not sure if you noticed that. That was cool. All right. Yep. Yep. Mm-hmm. Didn't feel good. What the hell am I supposed to do? Am I really just supposed to beat on her? It looks like it. I mean, I get a couple of hits in, but it don't look like it really do shit. But she can just fucking judo toss me. Come on. I just loaded in. I can't even do the final hit of the combo. Why do you hate me, Sable? Hey, I didn't allow nothing. I'm trying to stop him from stealing your stuff. Then you are failing. Badly. Oh, that hurts. You're not wrong. Who knows? Perhaps you are Get closer, Pete. Wow. Now I'm insulted. I do not know you. Obviously. And I do not trust you. You will stay out of my way or suffer the consequences. Stay out of your way while you do what? While I find and kill Hammerhead. Good luck with that. He doesn't die so easily. He has not Sable, can I say I really love your accent? It's beautiful. Can I can I have like a pallet to throw at you? Bad. Bad Sable. Bad, bad, bad. Bad beautiful silver lady. Ow. Oh, I did it! Wow, that was way easier than last time for some reason. You should shoot that guy. Why didn't you shoot him? You shot me when I was swinging when I was swinging around. You can't shoot that guy. God, I love how she hates me. Alright, well after that, time to switch the suit up, because we have like more than just the DLC suits to show off. We got those free update suits. Why did I go all the way to DLC? Alright, after this, we got the Spider-Man Cyborg suit. Sw Cyborg Spider-Man. Spider-Borg. Which, it's awesome but weird at the same time. I love it. 
stop Hammerhead from stealing all our shipments. Which is good. Maybe you guys can team up. Yeah, that doesn't feel very likely at this point. Listen, I'm gonna keep looking into the Simcaria story. If... Did you really just hijack my fucking conversation? I really hope I never see this character ever again after this game. I really hope so. I really hope Insomniac just went, Yeah, you know what? You screwball is stupid and nobody likes her. Hey, Screwball. I'm here at your stupid thing. Right? No, it's over here. I'm here at your stupid thing. I didn't even do the first two. You know, I feel bad for the voice actor of Screwball, because I'm pretty sure if I met whoever it was in real life, I would probably hate them too. Just out, of, just out of spite. How many things do I have? Oh, I only have two left. Wow. Huh. I didn't know I picked up that many. Oh man, Screwball, thanks for the challenge, and I'm not gonna do it. Goodbye. I have to get her behind bars before I turn into someone I hate. All right, MJ, back to what you were saying. Come on, call me MJ. MJ, I need you. Well, I don't need you, but MJ, I need you for the story. I need story, story progression, come on. I love how that sign just popped in. I'm gonna ignore it, though. Come on, ring my phone. You did it last time, there you go. Sorry we got cut short earlier. I had to deal with screwball. Again. You seem to have a lot of women in your life lately. Fuck off, MJ. Except for you, of course. Huh. You don't think I'm challenging? Uh, no. Nope, you're not. You're easy. Unless you want me to think you're challenging. Compared to your 70s uh, counterpart, you're super e way. easy. Definitely. Time, I'll swing around the city and do some spidey stuff. Spidey, I was already swinging around the city doing spidey stuff. I guess I'll grab these since I only have two left. And it's nice to have the map filled out. Even though I don't really need to do it. It just looks nice. Mmm. But he's so far away. And I'm so over here. I'll do that in a moment. Oh, it's in Central Park. Okay. Oh, I got nothing to swing on. There we go. Not getting much coverage. All right. I should look for more towers to activate. <coughs> Good job, Spider-Man. I got fucking. Something caught in my throat. How close is it? Oh, well, it's on my way there. Might as well pick it up. Come on. Come on. And we're out of the park. That's great. Hey, Peter. Uh, just in. hey Miles! How's it hanging? How are your assignments coming? School assignments or spider assignments? Both. Both. But school comes first. I'm all caught up on school stuff. Working on spider assignments now. But why are you making me do physics and calculus equations? Shouldn't I be practicing with web shooters and gadgets and stuff? Okay. Quiz time. If a pendulum is 40 meters long, 
and attach at a 45 degree angle. How far will the pendulum fall at its lowest point? 1147 meters. But why does that matter? It matters a lot if you're the pendulum. What? I have to. And so will you if you want to get good at it. Wow. I had no idea. Wow. Smart mathematical smart things make me a better hero smart mathematically. Mathematically speaking. Come on. There we go. I gotta fix my seating position every time. Every time I fucking... My leg falls asleep. It's the same fucking leg, too. <clears throat> Alright. Now onward to the main objective. Alright, I know that definitely picked up on my microphone. Somebody definitely just dropped something super heavy. I need to find a way to sound isolate this room. You know what I mean? But I'm afraid to do it. Because I'm gonna be moving somewhere in like a couple of months. So I'm not sure if I should hold out or if I should do it now. Eh, maybe I'll do it in like two weeks. It'll be nice just to have it. You know what I mean? <clears throat> Sound treat the hell out of this room. So I can stop every noise from entering. Open up. We'll open it for you. Leave me alone. Dude, you have like a super sci-fi gun. Alright, keep enemies from breaking into the truck. They can just shoot the guy if they wanted to. No. Bad. No. You stop it. Really? Really, I dodged too early? Really, Spidey? Go, go. But there you go. Huh. If they're going for the door, then fucking do something and help yourself, motherfucker. Slam the door in his face. Oh, he got lit up. Where's the other guy? You did not ignore me to go straight for that door. Where the hell? Ow! I wanted to ignore you. Where's the last guy? Okay, I was pressing the button to grab him. But Spidey didn't want to grab him. There you go. Now you can hang around for a bit. Were you guys just sitting there watching? You're damn right it was a close one. Hey, MJ, what's up? Shipping facility near Seaport. Got it. I'm headed there now. Question for you. Rob's from the rich. Huh. And a bunch of equipment from police lockup. Okay. <laughs> why is why does he have like freaky looking eyes? That's amazing. No idea. But if we can find out where, we can cut off the supplies. I'll try to cross reference this man's activity with the city map. See if I can't nail down a location. Good plan. Hey, so I've been reading up on the situation in Simcaria. There's a ruling dictator attacking his own people. Apparently Silver Sable's been working alone to arm the rebels and fight back, but she's losing. Sounds like she could really use the stuff Hammerhead is stealing from her. Explains why she's so angry. And does 
different. Maybe. But I also think that angry is just her default emotion. I'll let you know what I find at the It's a sexy emotion. That's what it is. Way better than MJ, which is bitchy. Silver Sable's cool. I like her. Well, I like this version of her. More than any of her other versions. Hey, guys. You shouldn't shoot at me. Don't you see how robotic I am? Oh, look at that flag. Isn't it beautiful? I wish there was more, like, uh... More, um... Challenging... Like, chase sections. You know what I mean? Because you catch up to these things pretty quickly. Hey, buddy. How's it hanging? He definitely didn't break his neck doing that. Hey, guys, slow down. You're leaving me behind. Come on, guys. Aren't we friends? Oh, hey, Sable. You're here to help out. Okay. Well, that was helpful. She's gonna kill someone. I mean, is that such a bad thing, Pete? What the hell is that thing? No, no, not the park. See, this is what I mean by more ch challenging chase scene. This is fun. Oh God, I totally forgot that this was a thing. Uh oh. Uh oh. Can you guys just slow down? Thank you. Sitting here playing fucking whack-a-mole with you motherfuckers. Uh. He was about to shoot me in the face. There we go. Now I just gotta stop the car with my super spidey strength. Oh my god, they're... They're definitely... Farther away. Come on, guys, slow down. Slow down a bit. Ow, he shot me. You're an asshole. That wasn't very nice. Man, for these cars, you really gotta mash the shit out of that button. Because if you, if you, uh, if you don't mash the shit out of that button, fucking, uh, what the hell, you guys just went past me. Did you crash your car? Or did she shoot the shit out of him? Oh, that's cool. Hey. How do I, does he just rip it off automatically? There's drones now? How did I forget about all this shit? Sable, I'm coming to rescue you, baby. Hey guys, stop shooting at the woman. Oh, I have to manually aim at them, for real? There we go. Don't worry, Sable, I got your back. Oh my god, she flipped the shit out of that car. Slow down, you son of a bitches. Too far away. I got you, Sable. Thank you, and some cars. Okay, now on to that last truck. 
Sable, Sable, I love you. Don't do what you're about to do. You got that look in your eye. That means you're going to do something really reckless and really sexy at the same time. Yep, that was hot. Isn't she beautiful when she's angry? Look into my cybernetic eyeball. Look how beautiful she is. She's so cute when she's angry. I love her. Right. We work together. Like partners. That doesn't seem trustworthy. What are you doing? Yeah. Partners. <laughs> so you'll call me? I love you, Sable. Best version of Silver Sable ever. Oh, that was fun. I like that. Onward to the next suit. The last suit of the DLC. Which is Into the Spider-Verse. Which is nice. Check it out. Speaking about Into the Spider-Verse, it was recently announced that, um, that for Miles Morales, they're having his, uh, his spider suit from Into the Spider-Verse, but not with the jacket and stuff, like just the regular spider, spider suit. And to make it all better and amazing, they, uh, they have the suit running at like 10 frames a second. Yeah, so? Well, according to Hook's law, elastic forces linear with distance given all factors are equal. But you and I aren't equal. Wow, you're right. Just a few pounds can affect tensile strength, rate of web fluid consumption. And a few other things. But I've done all the calculations. If we just tighten the nozzle diameter by 0.7 millimeters, it all pretty much evens out. I think I've officially underestimated you. I've created a monster. Seems like you're more than ready for field training. As soon as I'm done dealing with Hammerhead. Yes. Can I start practicing with the web shooters in the meantime? Nope. And if I find out you even left the house, I'll call it off. Man, you're like the most and least fun superhero ever. Miles, you're so cool. Yeah, but um, for Miles' spider suit, uh, in the game, they made it like run at 10 frames a second, which is amazing. And they also added, like, the nice little comic, uh, automatopias. Little kapows and wapooms. That doesn't look fun. Not exactly a fair fight. Let's even the odds a bit. Alright. Even the odds, even the odds, even the odds, even the odds. Alright, let's see. Let's, uh... How's this for even the odds? You. 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 I got one more. You. And you. Wow. That was fast. I didn't know you could just knock him out like that. That was amazing. Hey, buddy. How's it hanging? You have to teach me how you do all that. I wish I could say there was an art to it. Mostly, I just try to go where the bullets are. Well, I am in your debt. What were these guys after? These are humanitarian supplies from Pacific Area. You have heard of the civil unrest? I heard it was more of a civil war. Indeed. Well, these men attacked me and stole most of the supplies. Where they took them, I do not know. I'll keep an eye out and let you know if I find any. Nice to meet you, uh... David. David Obademi. Spider. Sp 
Spider-Man. Okay, that sounded way less awkward in my head. Yeah. You're a fucking loser. You're a loser, Pete. Hey, MJ. Can I just say, for the Spider-Verse design for Peter Parker, I fucking find his torso to be super weird. It reminds me of, like, a goddamn Titan from Attack on Titan. You see how wide it is? It's like Kylo Ren. It, it, ugh. It's like one of those weird Titans from Attack on Titans. You know what I mean? It's creepy. Concept. You two have to find a way to work it out. Hammerhead's too powerful to take on alone. My jailhouse source also said that Hammerhead's using. I don't know, MJ. She can kind of just shoot him with missiles. Further. Further. He was already a walking tank. Exactly my point. If you two don't stop him soon, he might become unstoppable. I love how they just basically Arkham Asylum the shit out of Hammerhead in this game. I mean, better Hammerhead than any other villain, right? Excuse me? What? What the fuck am I looking at? Hold up, hold up. Get up there, come on. Spider. Can you just go on the billboard so I can look at the damn thing? Jeans. You don't, you don't seem to be having a fun, a fun time there. That, that can't be good for your back. Okay, well. You can just hang around there. Okay, I'm just gonna ignore the fact that you all just popped into existence. Hey, it's pizza! Aww. I'm just your average New Yorker. Hey, I think that's the place that got a three-star review in the Bugle last week. You know what I find super weird? There's no option to just have, like, regular Peter Parker to be a, like, just a, you know, just a suit to run around in. Well, not a suit, but you know what I mean, like, as a skin. As a nice little cosmetic, just for fun. I think it would be fun, beating the shit out of people as Peter Parker. Amazing pizza. Delicious. Have to be Hammerhead's men. Better follow him, but not too close. So what do we got no, I'm just, you know, keeping your average New Yorker distance, and by that I mean like being all up in your face. Really? You did a shitty job on fixing the road? Holy fuck. Excuse me, lady. Blend in. Oh, they're right there. I didn't even notice. What you guys doing over here? Someone posted a cat. How's it hanging off, Zeus? That right now. Nah, all these kids look the same. He's also the one who helped the boss come up with that trap for the cable chip. Yeah, like that's never gonna work. I don't know. Sounds like a good plan. Excuse me, sir. A little bit of personal space here. A little bit. Of... Fuck off. So now you're on Tony's side. I see how it is. Hey guys, what you talking about? What's happening over here? Nothing. Where the fuck did these guys go? Oh, they're over there now. Alright. Oh! They actually give me a moment to actually do a little spider stuff as Peter Parker. That's awesome. Again, why isn't why isn't there a skin for this? If I get above those guys, I can hear them. Gotta get to that alleyway. See look, they have the assets in it. Why isn't there a skin for this? I can't super jump though. 
Come on, man. Look. I can do my little Peter flips. Shoes, maybe. Ain't that the truth? Anyways, Tony said he needs his laptop. Guess it's got all kinds of important stuff on it. That's laptop two. We put it up in C3. Slot C3, huh? If I can get Tony's laptop, it could lead me to Hammerhead. Thanks. Oh, wait. <laughs> Stimulating conversation, guys, but I've heard enough. Oh, come on, Spider. No stealth? Over that guy got a fucking free hit on me. Oh, I had those equipped. I didn't know. Ow. I don't know, it seems pretty easy to take you down, sir. Just like that. Yep, that was pretty easy. Okay, now where's that laptop? Well, Found it. Tony's laptop. Let's see if I can hack into it. A bing. Looks like he's got a find my phone app installed. Let's see where you are, Tony. Damn, Tony, you're pretty far away. There's no way a find my phone app would have this much range, would it? Research on some caria. I'll make it quick then. Your tip was a good one. I'm on my way to one of Hammerhead's top men. If anybody knows where Hammerhead is, it's him. That's great. And one of his guys mentioned setting a trap for Sable. What do you think that means? I think it means a bunch of old school mafia thugs feel threatened by a confident, powerful woman. Uh, God, right. get off the fucking fire escape, motherfucker. But I'm on a deadline, so. Yeah, totally. Talk no, no, by all means, MJ, blow me off. I'll just hang out with the hotter, f more fun chick. Hey, guys. My bad. Wrong, wrong area. I, I jumped the gun a little bit there. Hey guys, mind if I drop on it? Oh. No, I don't know when she's coming. You just gotta be ready. There's Tony. I don't think that's enough guys. Double it up. So what? I just beat the hell out of you guys. Well, let me get rid of that guy. Oh. That was supposed to shoot him away. Damn it. Well, anyway, unleash the spider drones. Ow. You shot me up like it was nothing. Ow. 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 See, that's what you guys get. Hey, Spider Man. Did you see that sable chick? Can you tell her? My boss wants to have a sit down. Yeah, I could. But she doesn't really listen to me. Or anyone. Hey, Sable. Give me the address. Wait, oh. Where, how did, the address! Klexco uh, building. Rooftop. Sable, I love you. No, wait, Don't leave me. Ambush. Look how cool she is. You know, Sable, word of advice, you can just go blow up the whole entire building. I won't stop you. That was a weird jump animation. Sable, you're headed into a trap. It does not matter. As long as Hammerhead is there. You don't get it. I'm trying to keep you from getting hurt. I can take care of myself. Usually you can. But Hammerhead... 
Hammerhead's been using your Project Olympus stuff. I know. Then you know he's turned himself into some kind of giant Franken monster. And that is why I must stop him. But not like this. Not by going right into a trap. Ah, Sable, what are you doing? Sable, slow down a bit. It's a little difficult to keep up with your awesome flying skills. Damn. 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 She just left me in the dust. What the hell? Huh. What was that fancy shit? Looked like an EMP. Did you get EMP'd? Oh, you didn't get EMP, but you got trapped. I can handle this. I'm sort of tempted to sit back and watch, but that would just be petty. They trapped her with their own tech. Looks like the whole thing is powered by those generators. Oh, that wouldn't affect nobody. Oh. There we go. Well, that was easy. Guys, slow down. Don't. You know, talking about your oh, don't tell me to shut up. You love it when I talk, Sable. Oh, shit. Don't worry, Sable, I got you. Oh, take him out. Yeah, fuck you and your gun. She just shot the shit out of him. Ow! I'm on your team. Ouch. Where's the other jetpack guy? Damn it. Changing position. Don't mind me. Just keep doing what you're doing. Fuck. That guy just what? Dude just teleported in. That was a cheap shot. I got distracted by fucking Nightcrawler over there. Fuck. Where is... where are these coming from? Uh, excuse you, sir. Some personal space, please. Eh, he'll be fine. Uh-oh! Okay, guys, give me some time. Thanks for the assist, Sable. Ouch. Damn it. Wrong guy. Come on, Spidey.
Yep, I'm definitely dying here. Shit. I wasn't even on the ground. Come on, man. If you're gonna hit me and kill me, at least make sure the hitbox matches. Jesus. Oh, back up there, Peter. Come on, Peter. At least let me be on the ground first before you shoot me. I mean, before you punch me. Blind guys are not fun. You just hit me with your fucking jet. Am I out of gadgets? I am out of gadgets. Well, that's not gonna do shit. God, guys, give me a fucking breather. Can I zip up there? I'm pressing the triangle button. Shit, come on. You did he? Oh, oh, my fucking God. Jesus, fuck. Fucking spider bot, help me. God, Sable, thanks. Holy shit. Can I? I'm doing the web zip. Sometimes it doesn't work. Hey, Sable, how's it hanging? Well, that didn't work. Table, please, any time now. <laughs> oh, hey, Felicia, wait, 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 you gotta go get Sable.
I'm not gonna lie, I totally forgot that Felicia shows up to save you. I haven't played this since it came out, and it's a pretty quick-ass DLC, so... Damn, Sable. <laughs> you can't just let her get taken away like that. Come on, Felicia, we gotta go get her. You're alive. Did you honestly think I was dead? Uh, how did you find me? Same way she did. Watch out. That girl has trust issues. How long have you been watching me? Watching us? Long enough to know you're making a mistake. Hammerhead's gotten too powerful. Do you really think I have a choice? Here. Damn, Pete, you got like a real, a real Listen. fucking pencil neck. Everything you need to know about that ugly thing. I love you, Felicia. I what I did to you. Don't leave me. One more thing. His head? Not as strong as you think it is. Bye, Felicia. Let's see what's on this thing. God, is every woman in this fucking universe way better than MJ? I feel like they are. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> Bonus objective, Olympus hideout. Bonus objective, don't I have to do it? Alright. Well, time to switch suits up again. We're gonna skip that one. Save that for last. Here we have the bombastic bot uh, the bab the papata the bombastic bagman suit when uh Spidey joined the Fantastic Four for that short while before they gave him the uh before they gave him what did they give did they give him the foundation suit during that Bases guarded by bionic madmen with futuristic weapons and impenetrable armor. That is quite illegal. Why don't I scope out their hideout first and get back to you? Thank you, Spider Man. I greatly appreciate all your help. Time to check in with MJ. Peter, are you okay? Hey, MJ, I'm calling to let you know that you suck. And, and, and Black Cat. Normally she brings bad luck, but not this time. Saving my skin, then giving me a lead on Hammerhead's hideout. Turns out he's been stashing all of the stolen Sable tech underground. What? How? I'm on my way to find out, and hopefully rescue Sable, if she's still alive. Listen, I've been deep into this Simcaria thing. It's a big story, something I feel like I need to be a part of. My boss agrees. Wait, you're going to Simcaria? When? Tonight. You're damn right about that, MJ. We don't need you. Oh, come on, MJ. Let the Avengers handle it. They got it. Do you trust me? You know I do. Then we're good. I gotta go home and pack. I'll call you tomorrow when I get there. I love you. I love you too. I don't love you, MJ. I missed her already. The entrance to his hideout must be somewhere close by. All right. 
Where's the entrance? Hiya! Can't hide from me! Oh. <laughs> of course. What, no loading tip? Just a fucking background? How do I swing around without having the bag fly off my head? Ugh, that's a new smell. Yuck. Hope I find Sable before the fumes overwhelm her. If I can get through this without getting wet, that'd be a win. Hello? amount of work it takes to make this city run is just crazy. I'll never take fresh water for granted again. Hmm. I'll be surprised if I don't see the fucking lizard popping around down here. Well, I guess I'm okay. Let's see where this leads. Looks like some loose bricks up ahead. Okay, onward. Get, get, get me through, damn it. Hammerheads, guys. They've taken over an abandoned subway platform. Gotta take these guys out, then look around for Sable. It's safe to take you out, right? You're damn right it is. Can I not just like take him out like this? Damn it. Uh oh. Get me the hell out of here. There we go. The game told me it was safe. I swear to God, if I get caught for doing that. Okay. What do we got left? Oh, that guy up there. He should be easy pickings. See? No problem. All right. Oh, I don't have any. No, I do. I guess I'm not in range. Fuck. Why did it go that way? No one's nowhere. No one's anywhere. No. 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 You stop. Give me like a better location. There we go. I can get him from here, right? There we go. Who's left? You three guys? Just the three of you? That's a big dude. Oh, I don't have any gravity shit. Damn it. There we go. Um, hello? There you go. That was a late reaction. There's still someone here? Oh. Is this reinforcements? Sir? Sir, you see nothing. You're done. Okay, that's all of them. Now, I bet if I follow the power cables, I'll find where they're holding Sable. 
Uh, down here? Nope. Hope that's not a load-bearing subway car. Wait, what? Oh, I didn't see that. Nice. Okay, follow the yellow wire. Better not find ah, tunnels blocked. But I think I can still squeeze through. Let's not get wet. How about how about we don't? Spider, come on, I know you can climb walls. Spider Man. There we go. Well, this just took a turn. Oh, I have to get wet. Something just touched my leg. It's fine. I'm fine. That guy didn't touch a thing like the other guys. Who was it? Don't remember his name. Sal's cousin, I think. Was it messy? Nah, he just came out all blue. I think he stopped breathing in there or something. Did you hook up the oxygen line like I said? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I think so. Ross ain't gonna like hearing, I think so. Then forget I said it. And I'll forget you were drinking on the job yesterday. What do you mean? That, that, that was classic. You're just not very observant. I've gotta do this quick and then find Sable. You guys are not, you guys are not, uh, quick on the uptake, huh? Hey, look at this. This looks important. That cop almost killed me. I thought you said I'd be indestructible. I said almost indestructible. After all, you are still human. Then make me less human. I'm... I'm not sure what you mean. I mean what I said. Now get to work. Oscorp scientist. Nothing else to look at? Just just a recorder? Alright. Oh, wrong button. Come on, Pete. Look at the damn thing. These things. I didn't design them. Guess we got the wrong guy then. On the bright side, now we got our first test subject. No, no, uh, don't, don't turn it on. Please, just give me a few minutes. I can figure it out. Now that's what I like to hear. Figure what out? What are you trying to do? Is there no tape recorder here or nothing? Not the most stair XRT-89. Subterranean troop deployment vehicle. That's the real name? <laughs> I'm sticking with Dig Boy. <laughs> I'm sticking with Dig Boy. <laughs> Dig Boy's a nice name. I like it. Do I not go through here or something? Investigate the hideout. No Fucking. And I really don't want to check those body bags. Maybe oh. Still some tunnel I missed. Same the yellow tunnel. light on this was <laughs> making them blend in. Hammerheads guys learning to fly in these things for the first time. Can I not open this up? What the hell am I missing? Pretty sure this is nothing. These guys work, huh? No windows, smells like a sewer, psychotic boss. Basically your typical office job. Do I not? Do I not go over here? Where the fuck? I can't imagine working in a place like this. Terrible feng shui. 
Where the hell do I go? Is that a door? Did I not check this? Wow. If Hammerhead gets his hands on this thing, we're in serious trouble. Can I not look at the map? What the hell? I came from over here. Okay, remember, Pete. Some bacteria are good bacteria. Do I not, like, crawl through this or something? What the fuck? How do I get out of here? I'll be trapped in here forever. For all my days. Sable. Sounds like she's close. Did I not? Did this get cut off? Uh... There what? What are you what are you talking about? Oh, so I do have to go this way. I just I guess I just didn't find everything. The only way out is through. Where the fuck am I going? Am I going down? Am I going up? I guess I'm going up. High voltage wires and sewer water. What could possibly go wrong? If there's one takeaway from this underground lair thing, it's that Hammerhead should have fewer thugs with guns and a lot more safety inspectors. Let's not touch the electricity. That seems bad. About to drill a fucking hole in her arm? Oh, he already drilled the hole in her other arm. Damn, Sable. Sorry I didn't make it sooner. You came back for me. Of course I would. Why? Because I need you. I work alone. I used to say the same thing. I know what's happening in Simkaria. I know why this means so much to you. I think you know, but you do not know. What can I do to make you trust me? Look, I think I know how we can take down that monster, but I can't do it alone. Damn it! You let him loose! That doesn't seem like a good thing. Why were you guys inside there? Good plan. Damn. She manhandled the shit out of them. Why were they inside that if they're just wearing suits? You're no different from the other guys I was beating up. <laughs> She's like, shut up and fight. Like, come on, Sable. Not even foreplay. Just, just down to business. Oh shit. Man, just a single punch just fucks my health up, huh? Like, I get him on a harder difficulty, but still. Oh, that's a that's a big guy. Teach me how to use them. 
Bok. Yes, I said Dick Boy. He punched me right in the face, too. Did you stop with the rocket launchers? Put it down. Damn it, I was trying to get the shield guy. Come on, buddy, just follow me a little bit more. That's okay. Dodge, please. Really? Uh-oh. Where's the, uh, where's the dude with the whips? Good shit, Sable. Ow! I tried to do that at the last second. Who's left? Those two? Oh, are we done here? Good job, Sable. Oh, that was cool as shit. Come on. Come on. You uh know you left me hanging, right? <laughs> Man, if I was Spider Man, I totally would have went for it. I would have said, dab it up. There's medical records in here. Yeah, mostly about that metal plate in his head. Carbon steel. Super strong, pretty sensitive to Heat. So we're gonna microwave his brain. Oh my god! <laughs> Please, Please? I have an idea. Damn it! I uh, solemnly swear to uh, do whatever you tell me to. I will call soon. Yes. Ow. But yeah. I love it when she's rough. I'll do some spidey work while I wait for Sable's call. Hey, what's that? Hey, some duct tape. We should check that out after I change my spider suit. Onward to the future foundation suit. Is this the same as the... Did he get this during the Fantastic Four shit? I mean, like in the comics, I don't think he did. But yeah. Future Foundation. It's not Cosmic Spider-Man. Cosmic Spider-Man is cool as shit. So is like Arabian Spider-Man. All the yellow stuff. Huh? Is this some weird street artist thing? What the hell am I supposed to be looking for? Am I supposed to be looking for more tape? What the hell? Scan for clues. I am scanning for clues. And my nose is itching. Alright. 
Oh, what's this over here? A police report. Looks like someone was killed during a mugging, but nothing was stolen. Hmm. What's with the audio recorder? So, you have some work-related stress. Well, you came to the right place. That's my specialty. Sorry, tell me. Give me some more specifics about how you're feeling. Guess you could say I put a lot of pressure on myself. I like to be the best. Plus, I have a very demanding boss. Yeah, what kind of work do you do? Everything here stays confidential, right? Of course. Good. Because if any of this gets out, you're a dead man. The case file says one of nine. There must be more of these out in the city. There's a bunch of GPS There must be more. We should totally check it out. But something tells me I'm not gonna find a chest full of gold at any of these places. I think I wanna uh actually search for these. Mainly because this is a short DLC. And I'm pretty sure we're closing up on the end of it. And I wanna show off the rest of the spider suits and give them like some nice time to you know be shown off. Let's see. Where? Mystery person's calling card. Where at? Where where do you see that spider? Oh. I'm blind as shit. G get up there, damn it. Hey Peter. Just letting you know Hey Miles. Glad to hear it. What's up? I've been listening to the police radio and there's stuff happening all over the city, like constantly. Pretty overwhelming, isn't it? How do you do it? I mean, you can't be everywhere at once. Remember what May used to say? You help someone, you help everyone. Yeah, but I never really understood what she meant. It's okay. You know that lady that came into Feast the other day with her two kids? The one who just got evicted? Yeah. After she found a job and was about to move into her new place, she told me, as soon as I get my first paycheck, I'm sending as much as I can back to this shelter. So we helped her and now she wants to help others. Helping is like a force multiplier. Exactly. May was pretty great, wasn't she? The greatest. I'm gonna send you an address as soon as I'm done with all this. So stay ready. And bring those web shooters with you. Finally! Finally! His voice cracks and everything. I love it. The last known location of a Magia informant who disappeared a few months ago. I'm feeling a little off. So why that's playing... Uh... Where the fuck is the rest of them? Do they not appear on the map? Crime scene recordings. Do I have to wait? I think I gotta wait for them. You a legend. Actually, what a... Huh. Guess I gotta wait for the recording to play out. Guy sounds like a Magia enforcer. Feels like this is just part of the story. I should keep. He said, "Oh, what? What? What are you scared of, Doc? I'm just a murderer. What are you scared of? I killed a bunch of people. All right. Let's go pick up the other one. Also, another reason why I'm picking these up is mainly because I have a feeling that they're going to be important <laughs> in the later games, either as a quest line or something. But you know." Probably the most important side quest out of all of them in this whole entire game. I should be close. All right, I am close. Where are we at? Where are they? I see no tapage. 
Oh. I thought I saw some for a moment. Is it up there? Am I blind? Is it up there? Is that tape? No. Oh, here it is. Really likes the color yellow. Is it in the middle? Uh, Spider-Man! You're supposed to web zip up there. God damn it. Come on, Spidey. What the hell? Is what I'm looking for in the middle of this? It can't be. Oh, there's more tape over there. Okay, I didn't see that. Let's hear what the recorder has to say. So what do you think, Doc? Well, clinically, you're a sociopath. You have no remorse for your actions. You clearly are not stressed. I doubt you think there's actually anything wrong with you. So, why did you really come see me today? You're smart. I like that. Okay, let's get right to it then. You do what I tell you, and I won't kill your family. Whoa. You want to get right to it? Okay then. I know why you're really here. I knew who you were the minute you walked in that door. And I also know that before I do anything for you, you're gonna do something for me. Well, that took a turn. These Damn. feel like colors for Maji. He said, oh yeah? He said, somebody call an ambulance, but not for me. Alright, there's another one over here. Might as well hit that place up. Hey, Sable. I've been meaning to ask, how exactly do you have a base in the city that I don't know about? Right, talk. Why is she always hanging up on me? Maybe she didn't hang up on purpose. She probably just got disconnected. She could be waiting for me to call her back. Or she could be running out of minutes on her cell phone plan. I mean, she's probably doing international roaming. That stuff is expensive. Or maybe she just really needed to polish her pistols. Let's apply Occam's razor. The simplest and most obvious solution is she hates me. Oh, I found it straight up. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, look at that. Look at that fucking mark out. Someone fell to their death from this ledge. It was ruled an accident. But was it? On the last recording, the therapist turned the tables on the Magia guy. Welcome back. Have a seat. So, did you bring the, uh... Do they really not appear on the map while I'm listening to them? Oh my god. Here, hope this takes care of your cash flow problem. Right. It most certainly does. Thank you. So, I assume you came to me because I have a few police officers as clients. You assume correct. My boss and I are only interested in one of them. And who might that be? Captain Yuri Watanabe. Yuri? How is she mixed up in this? I'm afraid of where this story is going. I have to keep following it. Okay. There's another one over here. Let's go pick that up. Here, oh shit! And here we are. It's got to be somewhere nearby. Another setup for me. Somewhere nearby. I mean, like over. Oh, I thought there was something hanging up over here. D -d Jump down, spider loser, spider dweeb. Why is the thing on here? All right, let's see. 
What, what the fuck am I stuck on? Oh. I mean... All the tape leads up here. What the fuck? Oh. Hello. Police ruled this a suicide, but Yuri had her doubts. The victim was part of Hammerhead's crime family. In the last recording, they talked about getting Yuri's mental health records. Here's Captain Watanabe's file. Hmm. Is everything? Yes. You ever record a session? No, I never record any sessions. That'd be unethical and illegal. Well, we'd like you to record our next session. And my boss has a list of questions he'd like you to ask. Is that gonna be a problem for you? No, no, no problem. I feel like I shouldn't be listening to these. And yet I can't stop. It seems that whoever left these wasn't... <laughs> and yet I can't stop. <laughs> it's like hentai. I shouldn't be watching these. And yet I can't stop. Alright. Let's switch to the upgraded suit from Spider-Man Far From Home, which I actually watched pretty recently for the first time. I like it. It's nice. I'm not sure if they meant to do this on purpose, but it's like, it's like a reverse, uh, it's, it's a, um, it's like a reverse Scarlet Spider suit. And a little bit of, uh, you know. Miles, uh, Miles, eh, can't speak. Miles, flare kicked up in there. You know the black on red. Oh wait, why am I going towards the objective? Fuck. <laughs> oh, I gotta go towards the objective regardless. There's two of these over here, and there's two of them over here. All right. Let's do it in a nice circle. So how far are we away from the, um, the, uh, launch of next gen? I think that's all happening next week. And I'm fucking, I'm praying and crossing my fingers that I can, um, <laughs> that I can fucking get one on launch date. Cause even though my area isn't really big on video games, um, surprisingly, I underestimated how many people would go for it, at least in my area, because usually it's not it's not hard to get anything day one where I live at. Not for me anyways. I think the last time I had difficulty doing it was like when PSVR came out, and that was just because they had a uh, limited, like limited quantity of them. And I managed to get like one of the last two they had in stock at like, <laughs> at like midnight. Not midnight launch, like midnight, um, the day came out. What the fuck did I just do? <laughs> I saw a marker and I just ignored it. I got there, ignored it, and turned around. All right. So what's here? Getting closer. I hope whoever's leaving these has a good reason. There's a report and recorder. I remember Yuri saying this was ruled an accidental death. Food poisoning, I think. All of these reports are from the last year or so. But last month, Yuri assigned herself to all of these cases. Was Yuri the one who left all those recordings? Okay, Yuri, let's move on. Have your obsessive thoughts about the suspect continued? Yes. Sometimes I feel like I've almost got it. And sometimes I feel like I'll never get it. Are you doing your breathing exercises? Trying to. But? I know who he is. I know where he is. And I know what he's done. But I can't do anything. Not without legally admissible evidence. That must be frustrating. You have no idea. C 
seems like Yuri's hunch is that the guy on the tape is the guy that killed all these people. I think she might be right. All right. Onward to the next tape, which is here. Oh, that's pretty fucking high up. Holy shit. Let's get some... some momentum. Get a nice... boost. There we go. And I lost all my momentum. Alright. Get off the thing, spider. Trademark yellow. The recorder must be around here somewhere. Trademark yellow. Where, you, where do you see that shit at? Oh. Is it not on top? There's another police report. Get, get, a, get on the thing. Can I not... Spidey, can you not climb it? Hello? A what? Why am I having such a hard time? There we go. I remember this. A person got electrocuted accidentally, but the victim had ties to Hammerhead. Yuri tried, but couldn't find evidence of foul play. On the last one, Yuri sounded frustrated. You have no idea. That's it? Yes. I mean, we talked a little bit about her medication, but... When is the next session? Why? What are you going to do? I'm gonna do whatever my boss tells me to do. Oh no. Are they setting up a hit on Yuri? Gotta get to those other locations. Lose bootleg ass fucking rush hour three. Alright, we have these two left. Eh, we have a bit of a swing in to happen over there. We can switch up to the other suit. The stealth suit. Not the stealth suit. What is it called? Sneak suit? No, it is called stealth snoot. Snoot? Did I just say snoot? Yeah. I don't know why they called it the stealth suit. They should have just called it the night monkey suit. <laughs> Who's that guy? It's a uh, night monkey. My favorite thing about that movie was fucking Peter Tingle. <laughs> I loved it. I loved it so much. So yeah, you got this uh, Peter Tingle thing. <laughs> Don't call it a Peter Tingle. Alright. Come on. There we go. All right. I think I'm getting close. Oh, looks like I found it. Come on. Come on, Pete. Come on, Pete. You can you can web There you go. I think there was a hit and run here recently. The victim was set to testify against one of Hammerhead's men. But of course, police never found a suspect. These case files are getting more and more recent. This one happened just a few weeks ago. You seem nervous. Yeah, well, the chief knew I was working undercover with you. I can't afford to lose my job. Maybe I should be the one doing breathing exercises. Well, isn't that interesting? Don't worry. I won't tell you to do that. Also, you're doing great. You are very authentic looking doctor. Thanks. I think. You think he knows you were wearing a wire? If he does, he's a hell of a good liar. He's a Magia enforcer. We know he's a good liar. Question is, does he know he's being lied to? We'll find out tomorrow, I guess. You sure about all this? If we catch him in the act of trying to murder a police officer, he gets put away for life. Yuri, what are you doing? I have to find Damn, Yuri. Damn. You really on some shit, girl. Don't worry, Spider Monkey will find the last tape. What the fuck? <laughs> what was that? Did I just go into like a fucking A pose?
All right, let's see. I think I'm close to the last crime scene location. Check it out. Yuri's been here. Now where's the file? Uh oh. There we go. Case file. And the last recording. Oh, damn it. All right. I remember Yuri telling me about a drowning here. She was suspicious because the victim was a competitive swimmer. <laughs> the competitive swimmer drowned. You ready for this? Ready as I'll ever be. I'm all wired up on my way to the office. Just picking up a coffee first. Okay. Drinks are on me when this is done. <laughs> Looking forward to it, Captain. Yuri's suspended, but she still won't give up. Hard not to respect that. I just get a large coffee. Oh, yeah, that. Then you would miss it all again, too. Oh. Hey. Damn. Oh, why did I listen to that? Because it was awesome. New side mission unlocked. Where at? How far away? How far are we talking? Where is it? Where the fuck is the side mission? Uh, I guess I gotta wait a little bit. Call from an unknown number. Hello. Hello, old friend. Yuri. Meet me at the corner of Madison and Twenty Third. We need to talk. Wait, wait, Yuri. Ah, she's gone. I'm coming, Yuri. What's to Yuri? She must be Don't worry, Spider Cops. Come to support you. Grizzly crime scene tour. She must have a lead on this enforcer guy. It'll be nice to see her. Maybe help her deal with whatever she's dealing with. I'm here to help you, Yuri. Don't worry. Spider caps are the jab. Did I land directly on the tape? Holy shit. That was awesome. That's the Magia Enforcer. Dead. And the case files from all his victims. This guy killed all these people. But does that mean he deserved to die? Uh, yeah. Yuri. I know what you're gonna say, but just hear me out. The system works most of the time. But there are times when it doesn't. And to me, that's unacceptable. Some people put their trust in fate, or karma, or whatever. But I can only trust me. You can't kill people, Yuri. Apparently I can. And you know what? It felt good. You need to turn yourself in. For what? I just dispensed justice. True justice. And I restored a little bit of balance to the world. You're my friend, Yuri. I don't want to come after you. Have to do, and I'll do what I have to do. Goodbye, Spider Man. Yuri, what am I gonna do? This all makes sense now. What Yuri did to Hammerhead, she's been struggling with this for a while. She's always held in her emotions, that must take a toll on her. But she's also the most tenacious and stubborn person I know. This was a bad guy for sure, but killing him. It's too much. Damn, Yuri. That's crazy. You didn't have to go that far. You actually did have to go that far. It was so it was awesome. Keep doing it. I won't tell nobody. It was cool as fuck. Anyways, reason I wanted to do that is because I believe there's a follow-up comic to uh this in which Yuri becomes the Wraith, I think. And of course. Since we're getting towards the last mission, let's end it off with a bang, right? The good old classic Spider-Man movie, Spider-Man suit, Sam Raimi, I believe it's Sam Raimi, right? Sam Raimi suit, you know, fucking, uh, why is the actor's name, why am I blanking on it right now? Uh, Tobey Maguire, there you go, shit. Totally forgot his name for a moment. Oh, 
Oh, hey, look at this. This is hanging off the edge precariously. That is super dangerous. Holy shit. Holy shit. That is a... Really? That is really dangerous. That can't be, like, regulated, can it? I'm sorry, was that car driving in the middle of the road? Just in the plain-ass middle of the road? Oh, hey. Hey, Sable. How's it hanging? Is the has the glass not loaded in? Your toys are so okay, much fucking fun. shield. <laughs> so what we do is say, well, what are we up to? This invisible floating fortress thing. But now that all of New York City has seen it, Hammerhead will probably be here soon. I am counting on it. So let us work quickly. I have acquired the Class 5 laser array. We need to calibrate it to prevent it from overheating. Lucky for us, I'm working on my master's in calibration. Let's do this. Oh, I wouldn't be a Spider-Man game without science, science. Whoa, nice laser. Housing locked. Done and done. We are not done. Oh. We must reset the targeting field, Ariel. Sure thing. I have no idea what you're talking about. Exit the hangar and navigate to the top of the nearby transmitter. All righty. So, we should talk about the strategy with Hammerhead, don't you think? What is there to talk about? Find him. Then focus the laser on the plate in his head. The laser will keep... She said, find him and shoot him. ...temperature, which will rearrange its molecular structure. And soften it so I can knock him unconscious. I get that part, but how do you know it won't, uh, melt his brain? When the wolf attacks the sheep, he risks getting shot by the shepherd. Okay, well, Shepard, just remember my no-killing rule, okay? Done. How's it look? Systems appear functional. Hey, man. Pete, maybe you can't, maybe you can kill Hammerhead. Just, just, just a little bit, you know? Just, just end him. But I do need you to launch those targets. Right. Okay, ready? Ready. Launching targets, what targets? Target launched. Catch this one. Oh, there's more over here. Comes another one. Nice shot. Is this how modern militaries do skeet shooting? Oh, oh, can we do one more? Please? You are a child. Yeah, well, we're all children on the inside. Uh, whoa. Uh, Come back. We have one more thing to do. On my way. Must adjust the gyroscopic navigation stabilizer in order to compensate for the weight of the laser. Go to that terminal and wait for me to activate the system. System ready. I'm going in. Okay, that should do it. Oh, hey, Hammerhead. Look at that pixelated ass laser. You two teaming up now? Damn, Hammerhead, you're still fucking ugly. You really tried to headbutt me? Like, for real? Okay. 
Uh oh. Oh shit. Now I can get in close. It's a fight you ain't gonna win. Ow. I need reinforcements. Now. Fuck you and your reinforcements. Shit. You guys are really not helping me out here. Put the gun down. Ow. Oh, come on. That one was cheap. Ow! Fuck! Woo! Alright, let's just pretend that didn't happen. Fuck. I don't know, man. It seemed like it hurt you pretty much. Pretty much? Is that is that a way you say that? What's it gonna take? You know what I respect? A guy who knows when to quit. Commencing bombing run. Bombing? Damn. I missed. Keep them coming. I'll make sure the next one hits. Yeah, sounds like a plan. Good shit, Shable. Shable? Did I really just say that with a lisp? Good job, Sable. Shoot him the fuck up. I was born ready. Ow! You're supposed to be getting... ...stunned by that! Ah, shit. Really gotta mash the shit out of that button. Oh, take down. Hell yeah.
Can I get rid of these guys? That was my fault. That was so my fault. Oh, come on. Come on. I had to land straight on the goddamn static electricity. That was my fault for trying to be cool. I don't know how far I got set back with this shit. I was having a pretty easy time doing it, too. What? I was a mid-dodge. Oh, that was bullshit if I ever seen any. God damn it! What the hell? I'm mashing the shit off the button! What do you mean it's overheating? Damn. That was cool. You're cool. So how do we know if he's dead or alive? He's a robot. Hey, do you have dinner plans? I know this great Please say no. Place. Come on, let's get pizza. Must return to Simcaria. Damn it. Right. You have a war to fight. I do not like to fight. Do what I have to. You're pretty sexy when you're doing it though. I know. That's what heroes do. I am no hero. But you have taught me a few things. Oh yeah? Like what? Like how to disarm my enemies with bad jokes? Actually, they're good jokes, but I understand humor can be subjective. Thank you, Spider-Man. For everything. I don't do hugs. Yeah. Right. Oh, come on. Uh, hey, can I get a lift back to the city? Uh, I'd, I'd swim, but it'd take forever to get the river smell out of my suit. Are we not gonna pick up Hammerhead? We just gonna leave him there? <laughs> he's sitting, he's like laying down in fire right now. Okay. Well. I guess we'll just leave it there. That was a pretty abrupt ending. Ah, uh, yes. Excelsior. In memory of Stan Lee. Who has inspired us all. He is the greatest of us. I do like this score though. This is a nice score that plays. Score, piece. A score is a whole ensemble, right? Not ensemble. It's it's the whole collection of pieces, right? Anyways, it's a nice it's a nice piece of music. I like it. So 
that was Spider-Man, the, uh, the Sleeping City DLC. I think that's the name of the whole entire package, right? Yeah, Sleeping City DLC, because it's, uh, it's the highest is Turf Wars, and then it's Silver Lining. Um, I think it's a good piece of DLC. It's nice. I wish that, I wish that the DLC, um, did a little bit more in terms of, uh, in terms of finding a way to make side quests better, not in terms of main content, because the main content is nice enough, and each DLC is about, like, an hour 30 to two hours, so that's fun. Um, it's a, it's a lot of, it, it's a nice hefty amount of content. I think altogether when the DLC came out, I think it was, uh, was it $15 a piece? Was it like a $40 DLC? I think it was. I, I can't remember. But it's uh, it was pretty much worth the price. Uh, more Spider-Man. Definitely, um... Definitely harder than what I remember it being. I'm not sure if they updated it or something, or if it was like... Or just, that's how Ultimate Mode was when the DLC came out. But it's definitely way harder than the main game. And I think most of that is just due to how much damage the fucking enemies do. It's ridiculous. As for, like, the speedball shit, I don't like speedball that much. They could have just, like, replaced her with uh, Taskmaster. Um, s since he was already in the main game. And, I mean, there's no reason why they couldn't have done that. Right? Because speedball's in the main game, too. So... They both give Spider-Man, like, challenge missions to do. So they could have really just done Taskmaster. I'm not sure if, uh, if there was, like, something, if there was, like, some sort of, like, I don't know. I don't want to say licensing, because it's a, it's a Marvel Studio game, so they could have used Taskmaster if they wanted to. But, like, I don't know, man. Maybe Disney was all like, nah, you can't do it, bro. I, I don't, I don't know why they didn't use Taskmaster, just to, just to, um, do the challenge shit because it makes more sense than speedball right speedball is just a loser i hope i never fucking like i always joke about how i think characters are losers and shit speedball it's a legit actual fucking lame ass like i really hope she never shows up in miles morales i don't want to see her in any other spider-man game i just want her to be left and forgotten there's nothing good about her and she's not even like a fun annoying character right there's annoying characters that are fun like, almost everyone from Invader Zim. <laughs> Even though Invader Zim is a really fun show that I like, like, half those characters are super annoying, and that's the point. And it's fun. But Screwball just sucks. There's nothing there. There's nothing there at all. Um, really hope that Miles Morales is able to, um, to, you know, give us some real good side missions to do. Like, they don't have to be crazy good or anything like that. They just be on par with, like, Arkham City. Because even Arkham City didn't have that good side missions, but at least they were noteworthy, right? They had something that made you, like, go, Wow, that's cool. That's nice to look at. Right? Um, instead of all of them just being, like, Go follow generic fucking copy place character and, and do generic things. Like, I'm pretty... I'm pretty sure there has to be something with uh, Yuri Watanabe and fucking and Miles Morales. Because cause they really did a good job building her up in this uh, DLC. Like, they didn't give her too much, but in Turf Wars, they gave her a lot. So that was nice. Um, I do like <laughs> I do like the conversations that, that uh, Pete and Miles have, which I'm really interested, interested in how how in Miles Morales, like, how that's gonna play out, because even if my, I don't know, I, I guess it can play out in a way where, like, because we know Pete's not gonna be there, and Miles has to protect the city while Pete is gone, but Miles can just call Pete and be like, yo, there's a, there's a problem going on, I really need some help, man, right? Um, who knows, maybe that'll happen at the end of the game, like, the later half end of the game, but either that or maybe, um, Minor spoilers, I guess, but it was announced that the main character, the main antagonist, well, not main antagonist, but one of the big forces that is going to 
be against Miles is the Tinkerer, which is interesting because you don't really see the Tinkerer a lot. You usually see him with like Avenger stuff, from what I remember. Usually he's like maybe working with Doctor Doom or some bullshit. But um, yeah, maybe maybe in Miles Morales there'll be like some sort of like citywide communication disruption system and maybe that's why he can't talk to Pete or something I don't know um who knows it can go in a multitude of ways uh I really want to see how Mayor Osborne will play into Miles Morales as well especially with the uh with the stinger ending that we got at the end of um at the end of the main game for Marvel Spider-Man I really hope that I, I believe I said this at the end of the main game of, of my playthrough where you know where I'm what I'm doing right now when I talk over the credits I believe that I said I hope I at least said it but my whole I my whole expectation from this uh Spider-Man game series is is like like we I feel like we're definitely gonna have like a Batman Arkhamverse type like four game quadrilogy who knows for me they might do a fifth game who knows but i feel like we're definitely gonna get four games out of this whole entire series from insomniac who knows maybe one of them won't be from it's not from insomniac but i don't see why it wouldn't be um and i said that at least i remember saying i hope i said it that i was happy that they got they got rid of uh not got rid that that's a bad way of phrasing that but i'm happy they did everything with the aunt may stuff so that in like a sequel we don't have to deal with that as like a cripple for pete right use it as a growing point we got rid of the the aunt may stuff rid of the fucking you know he says she said love story mary jade watson and fucking pete stuff great i'm happy so we can move on and hopefully we don't have to worry about that shit later on Miles was implemented, and what I really wanted was for the next game, right, which, even though Miles Morales isn't a full game, it's a standalone, like, maybe six to seven hours long game, um, they are doing what I really wanted, was that give a game for Miles himself, maybe Miles and Pete working together, but mostly Miles for his coming-of-age story, and then for the third game, when they want to do Venom, they can put Venom in there, but just fucking stay away stay away i mean i'd rather have miles and pete work on something big but the fact that miles getting his own thing that's nice that's really nice i think that's even better but i still want to see more of the i hope they somehow incorporated more of um pete and miles working together somehow and not just have the game be full on miles by himself because i feel like we still need that dynamic to be built up in this universe and in terms of like Venom and like uh, New Goblin and stuff like that, fucking for the third game, right? Because I'm going to count Miles Morales as a second game, even though it's a standalone. For the third game, if they want to put Pete and Miles teaming up to fight Venom, they can do that. Just stay away from Carnage until you deal with Venom completely. And then if you want to do Carnage, do that in like the final game as a final hurrah. Because fucking the Amazing Spider-Man games, even though those games are ass, those games are really terrible. Um, and they're not that terrible. They're like average games. But in those games, they definitely, they definitely went as, they went straight towards Carnage in the second game. And they were like, and there was really like no reason for them to do it. Right? And I feel like nowadays Carnage, since people know him more which is weird because back in the day nobody knew who the fuck carnage was unless you played maximum carnage or unless you read the you know unless you played marvel ultimate alliance or you read the fucking or the comic series or the comic line stuff right um i just really don't want them to rush into carnage i don't want them to rush into carnage if they're gonna have carnage have him be his own thing as like maybe the final game in the series and maybe if they want to if they want to work on implementing a third playable character as Venom because Carnage is Carnage and you are going to need Venom's health or if they do do five games then one game 
Spider-Man. Second game, Miles Morales. Third game, Spider-Man, Miles Morales fight current I mean fight Venom together, right? Fourth game, maybe Venom gets his own game and he can deal with uh, the the fucking um what's call it? Separation anxiety, right? He can deal with uh Riot Phage, uh Scream. What's the other two? Fury. <laughs> I can never I can never remember the other two. Fuck, it always gets me. It's fucking like what is it? It's Riot, Phage, Scream. I think one of them is Fury. And I don't remember what the other one is. I don't remember what the last one is. I'm really trying to think right now. For some reason, I want to say Pestilence, but it, of course it's not Pestilence. The character's not called Pestilence. Um, that That's like a different Marvel character, right? That's what a speedball turns into. Right? He turns into Pestilence or something where, like, he has to hurt himself to give himself kinetic energy and do, like, blast and shit or whatever. I don't know. Fucking whatever. But fourth game, if they do a fourth game, maybe give Venom his own game so we can do that. But I don't think Venom really needs his own game. But if if they do do five games, maybe Venom will get his own game. And then for a last final hoorah, like, Venom's game will lead up to Carnage. And then fucking the final hoorah would be all three of them working together to beat carnage right and then and then just end it there right and maybe maybe like in terms of game progression it would be like five years in the future not five years in terms of game development five years in terms of in-game story right you know fucking when they're fighting carnage maybe miles morales is out of high school and stuff like that maybe he's 20 and pete's like 27 um, but would that work? Yeah, that is five. He's 15 right now, right? So he would be 20 and then Pete would be 27. Okay. Um, and then, yeah, who knows? They can take it a bunch of other ways. Cause they're also playing up the whole, uh, Harry and, uh, you know, Harry, Pete and MJ's like childhood and stuff. And who knows what they'll do with Osborne. But, yeah, fucking, that's pretty much it. I went on a little, I went on a little tangent there, a little tirade. But, as for the DLC, it was worth it, uh, in terms of, in terms of the story content. The side content, uh, most of them are just challenges that Screwball gives you. The, f of course, the most fun ones are, like, the races to me, because the combat ones are a little bit wonky. Sometimes you want you to do certain things, and it just doesn't work out. One of the things that really didn't work out was uh, she has the photo bomb missions and stuff like that. I think those make a comeback, but I remember doing it, and I got stuck in the slow motion mode for the photo bomb, and I couldn't move or anything, and I just got the shit beat out of me. Uh, I'm pretty sure they fixed that by now, or maybe it was just, like, a single-time glitch that I have, but... I really hope, so far it seems like Insomniac's doing a lot good with the Spider-Man series, not just in terms of gameplay as a game, but in terms of story, because they're taking a lot of liberties in it. Like earlier in the last stream when I did Spider-Man, I said that um, Jefferson Davis, Miles' father, fucking, he ne usually he's not the one that dies, right, in the comic line. He's, he's, um, he's the one that's alive and Rio dies, right? And what's really interesting here is that uh, Jefferson Davis actually has a tolerance for Spider-Man. Well, he had before he passed away. Had a tolerance for Spider-Man where in the comic line, he hates superheroes. He can't fucking stand them. And usually that's something that, uh, that, um, that Miles would have to struggle and fight with. And even in Spider-Verse, uh, Spider-Verse was also new to that as well. That concept where he didn't hate heroes, right? He felt like anyone could be a hero. Um, and the same thing with Rio, his mom, like, she has nothing against heroes either in this continuity, so that's really interesting that Miles doesn't have to go against that. And instead of that, he has to just, you know, work on his own thing as Spider-Man instead of kind of keeping it separated. Now, there was, minor spoiler, because it was a leak, because uh, the voice actor for Miles recorded a session, and uh, he recorded a session, not recorded, well recorded, yes, but he had like a, a fucking Snapchat or something. 
and like he was he was recording some lines for one of his sessions and in it he took he uh miles was talking to his uncle i'm not gonna go too much in details with that but if you know about miles and if you know about his uncle you know whose uncle is and you know that's a big part so not sure if that's gonna be a mainline story thing or if it's gonna be a uh or a um, side quest of some sort or something like that. I'm pretty sure it's going to be a mainline story thing. I see... I don't see why not. Um, Because it's a big part of Miles' uh, journey. And it's very interesting. It's very interesting and I love to see all the spins they um, take with it. So, I think that's everything I wanted to say for for miles uh for for miles morales for uh the spider-man dlc and future coming miles morales again i don't know if i'm going to stream miles morales on launch date i'm not even sure if i can get a ps5 on launch date i'm pretty sure i'll i'm not sure but i have on good authority that i will end up getting one on launch date usually it's not that hard for me to get anything um day one but this is a really different circumstance that i'm in and even if I do get the PS5, I'm not sure if I'll stream or record Miles Morales, mainly because, like, usually with new releases, especially when it's a uh, launch-up lineup for a new console, um, everyone's going to be recording it, everyone's going to be streaming it, even if they don't have the PlayStation 5 version, they're going to stream the PS4 version. Um, within, like, four days of... Within like four or three days before it comes out, you're going to see full playthroughs and full boss fights and everything and the whole story. There's going to be a video that says fucking Marvel's Miles Morales, Marvel Spider-Man Miles Morales PS5 full movie. You're going to see a fucking a video on that shit or some shit somewhere on, on, uh, on YouTube. So when it comes to launch date shit... Usually I try to stay away from recording stuff like that. There's a lot of competition for it. Um and I'm not I'm not gonna sit here and try to be like the guy that's like, come and watch my playthrough of it, right? Don't watch that guy's playthrough. Watch watch, watch my playthrough. Yeah, it's me. But me though. But me though. Not about not about you or not about that guy, but me. <laughs> right? Uh but I will I definitely will be a Usually when it comes to certain games, I try not to touch them until I record them. Um, because I love recording first time experience with the game. I think that's a real genuine, honest reaction to everything without being like, Oh my god, look at this, it's so cool. Um But definitely when the game comes out, I am gonna be playing Miles Morales on my own time if I don't record it. And then same thing with some other games on PS5 launch. I'm not sure what I'm still getting on launch date. Because, you know, you got to drop money on the console, then you got to buy games. And then now I'm trying to, um... At this point, I don't know if I want Cyberpunk on my fucking console or my PC. <laughs> I was buying Cyberpunk for my, uh, for my, P for my PC, but now, since it's gotten delayed again... I don't know, man. I might just buy two copies. Um, but yeah, now that's everything I wanted to say for Spider-Man. So I'm going to skip these credit sequence. We watched it for long enough. That serves as a nice little ender for our playthrough. And we get this awesome end scene here. Ready? I think the web shooters are a little tight. Get used to it. Just try to keep up. Don't break your toe, bitch. All right. And then Miles fell to his death. Where is he, Pete? Congratulations, you have finished the Silver Lining story that concludes the city that never sleeps saga. Good job. Hammerhead's finished. But his you know what? Still out there. It just it just occurred to me. Maybe we'll see more Black Cat in Miles Morales. It'll be nice if like Miles needs a little bit of help, but since Peter's not there, Black Cat shows up and she's like, "Oh, so you're Spider Boy Junior?" <laughs> right? Um. But yeah, that is it for the Spider-Man DLC. So, for those who are watching on Twitch, 
thank you very much for coming and watching the content. It helps out a lot. Did I just smack into a wall? Yep, I did. Look at that spider ass. Anyways. <laughs> um, that is it for this. I'm going to... Actually, let me see how much time do I have left. Where the fuck? Here's my phone. <laughs> see my phone. Um, oh my god. Really? Huh. Really? That's the time I have on here? Okay. Well, that's interesting. Um, shit. <laughs> I wanted to do Arkham Asylum along with this, but I guess this took longer than I thought it would. Um, and if I'm going to do Arkham Asylum, I want to do like a good hefty amount of it. So I guess I'll save that for tomorrow. I'll save that for tomorrow. So tonight we're going to end the stream here because this lasted longer than I thought it would. But, you know, give it a nice hefty amount of time for the, uh, for the, uh, whatchamacallit. For, for uh, the YouTube audience, a nice, a nice long stream for you guys to watch. It's beautiful. Um, so next time on stream, I'm either going to be doing Corpse Party or Arkham City. Uh, I believe I said this last time, but for Arkham City, I definitely have off screen. I did all the Riddler trophies and stuff, so we don't have to worry about that no more. And, and, uh... Yeah, that's pretty much it for that. Corpse Party, on the other hand, uh, I just gotta look at some of the setup stuff for that. Not that it's a problem or anything, just I want to make sure the game runs fine, because I didn't know that game didn't have controller support. I thought it would, because I believe that game was also on the PS Vita, so I'm going to be playing the PC version of that. Even though I, I could have bought the PS Vita version, the PlayStation, the PSP version, PS Vita version of the game. Um, but the first Corpse Party, uh, we're going to be taking a look at that. So, prepare to see that in the near future. If not tomorrow, then definitely the day after tomorrow. And then, after that, we'll finish. We'll finish. We'll uh, look at Folklore, and if I can, depending on the schedule, we'll uh, do Monster Camp. Because I still want to do more of Monster Party and Monster Camp just released a couple of days ago. So that would be nice to do that. And apparently there's a there's another plan for uh, December to have like a Christmas DLC for Monster for Monster Prom, uh, Prom. I stuttered like hell there. I had like a stroke. Yeah, so I think they're going to do Christmas DLC for Monster Prom. Did I call it Monster Party? Shit, my bad. And then... If not this week, then definitely next week we're going to be continuing Phoenix Wright, finishing that up. Uh, we're at the last trial in the middle of the last, well not, in the middle of the last chapter. That's why I meant to say. And then once we finish that, we're going to be moving directly on to Phoenix Wright 2. Because I want to continue that game series. And that right now is the plan for the streams. As for the YouTube channel, um, we are doing Vampire currently. Vampire. I keep calling it Vampire. I like calling it that. We're doing Vampire currently. And, and even though I haven't put out a part five yet to that series, um, we are continuing it. I plan on finishing that series. It's just that that game has... <sighs> I gotta find more time to record that, and that game also has an autosave feature, so if anything glitches or crashes or fucks up, um, it's gonna be a pain in the ass to, uh, get shit back. And, yeah, there's some other playthroughs I have planned for the channel, which I do not feel like talking about right now. And, I believe I said this last month, at some time... Hopefully before the end of this year, I'm going to be taking a look at the older playthroughs I have on the channel that I was never able to finish. Um, some of them are just going to be deleted completely, while others will... Well, they'll be deleted completely and, and re-recorded, while others will just be continued. So, for example, Persona 4, that's going to be deleted completely and just re-recorded because I'm not happy with that. 
um i didn't have a clear plan going into that and the audio the audio in that in those video series is not that good um but other things like pokemon for example that won't get deleted that'll just be continued so look forward to those and yeah i'm trying to see right now there are two big projects that i'm working on in the background that i don't want to talk about too much but there's going to be like two big videos either this year or next year coming out um maybe three depending on how the schedule goes and then i think that's it for everything i think i think there's that and right now i'm trying to see if i can plan a if if i can get something in the works going on for the month of december there's something that i really want to do that i've been waiting to do for a long time and then um i also want to see if i can if I can do a certain marathon of a certain game series uh, around December, I'm not going to say what it is, and I'm not going to promise anything, because, you know, I have a lot of shit going on with, like, with, like, uh, with, like, future moves coming up and fucking, um, and, um, fuck, I can't speak. <laughs> with future, with, like, a future move coming up with me and some other people, and then... And then there's also a matter of, I right now I, th right now I'm trying to see I can't I can't say if anything's set in stone yet. But right now I'm in talks with uh with getting a new job. So that's gonna be fun. And maybe depending on how that goes, my whole schedule will be flipped upside down. I don't know. There's a lot happening right now. The Corona times are not fun times. I'll tell you that. Um. <laughs> so I didn't mean I didn't mean to ramble on for too long, but it was just something that I really needed to say for the people watching and then for the YouTube audience. Um this will probably be like a nice little separate video for itself as an update. But uh This is definitely where we're ending things off at. Again, for those of you on Twitch watching this, thank you so much for coming out to the stream. Thank you so much for watching this stuff. Um, please do check out the YouTube channel, and please, uh, if you're interested, follow me on Twitter, because, uh, because I'm trying to be more active on there. I have some fun, fun thoughts on things that I like to say, and, yeah, so, thank you, Twitch audience, and for the YouTube audience, you guys, same goes for you, thank you guys for watching. It helps out a lot just for watching these VODs, even if you're not, even if you're not watching live. Um, maybe check out some other content. There's a lot of videos I got on my channel. Uh, some of them are garbage, some of them are not. Uh, just give them a try. I, I can't promise if you'll, if you'll like them or not. But, yeah, if you're subscribed and you don't have the notification button clicked, please do so. Uh, mainly because I just want you guys to get notified whenever something happens. Uh, you can really, I really don't give a fuck about the YouTube algorithm shit. Um, and I think that's all I wanted to say. Same thing. I'm on Twitter. If you want to see me on Twitter, there should be a, there's a link in the description and stuff. And, and, ne oh shit, I didn't know I was chasing a guy. And next time I have a poll. I'm not sure when I'll have it. But it'll probably be a while until I put up another poll for live streaming. Probably until after we beat Corpse Party and like enter um, Phoenix Wright 2. But yeah, please, please look out for those. Please look out on the community tab. That's where a lot of updates are going to be coming from. And yeah, just thank, thank you for supporting and everything like that. It really helps out. It really keeps me going making these videos, knowing that people like watching them. Even if it's for like five minutes or something, I don't know. So, with all that said... Fuck. <laughs> that was a whole mouthful. Once again, I want to thank everybody for watching. Let me, let me perch up on a building or something to look cool. Once again, 
I want to thank... Come on, Spider-Man. Really, you're ruining it for me. You're an asshole. You did this last time. Look, look at the... Just like mamas, huh? All right. Once again, I want to thank everybody for watching. Uh, it helps out a lot. And I will see you guys in the next video. Stay happy, stay healthy, and take care.